In the last video, we discussed about the extended Euclidean algorithm that is the CDF A comma B equal to S into A plus D into B formula number representative okay. S into A T into A value evaluate and it is the extended Euclidean algorithm you see there. When the process number we have the equations are same as three set of variables are used R, S and T is R and equation for the other S into A value and T into A R1, R2, R3, S1, S2, T1, T2, I have to change it. That's the difference. We will see some problems. So, given A equal to 161 and B equal to 28. We will see the and the values of S and T. So, we will see the algorithm in the table. We will see the table in the table. We will see the table in the table in the first four columns. R1 and R2 and Caution and Remainder. In addition, we have two set of variables. S1, S2, S2 are the three variables. T1, T2, T2 are the three variables. We have to use this portion for evaluating the value of S. And this portion is for evaluating the value of T. So, we have to use R1, R2 and Caution. We have to use this value of E, A and B. So, R1 is equal to 161 and R2 is equal to 28 that is a day b day values in the first number quotient that is 161 divided by 28 we will get the quotient as 5 and remainder is 21 28 into 5 is here but the 161 in the correct here but the remainder is 21 so it's a number of partner to say that yes it's a next number s in name t in name operation like an opponent we have to say that S1 and S2 are initialized as 1 and 0 and T1 and T2 are initialized as 0 and 1. Now, S1 is the first value of 1, S2 is the first value of 0. Now, we have to evaluate the SE value of the SE equation. S1 minus Q into S2. R1 will be used as the equation. R1 minus Q R2 will be used as the SE value. In the SE value, S1 minus Q into S2. S1 minus Q into S2. Now, we have to evaluate the SE value. That is, we have to evaluate the SE value. 1. 1 minus Q is 5. 5 into S2. That is 0. 1 minus 5 into 0. Now, answer the term is same as 1 at 0. So, we S in the value 1 get it. Then, we need to find the value of T. T and we can look at the equation of T1 minus Q T2. T1 in the value 0 on it. That is 0 minus Q is 5. 5 into T2 in the value 1. So, 5 into 1. That is minus 5. 0 minus 5 into 1. That is minus 5. Now, we have to do the first step. We have to do the first iteration. Next, we have to do the value exchange. Next, we have to do the value exchange. That is, R2 will have to do the value exchange. R1 will have to do the value exchange. R1 will have to do the value exchange. This is the process. We have to do the same thing. 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 S2 लोला value S1 लेगे दो, S2 लोला value S2 लेगे दो, अत वाले T2 लोला value T1 लेगे दो, T लोला value T2 लेगे दो। तो next step लेकर लो input समझ गए थे। इन्हीं 28 divided by 21, we will get the quotient of 1 and remainder as 7. R ने evaluation करी है। Next step हम लोग के S से evaluate है ना। S से निपटा था value 1 less than 1 नो, S2 less than 0 यू, S2 1 नो आना। अब हम लोग के S वैल्यू दिया है ना इक्वेशन S1 माइनस Q इनटू S2 अब S1 ले वैल्यू सेरो है ना अब फर्स्ट पोर्शन पूरी सेरो माइनस Q इक्वल टू वन ना वन इनटू S2 लंदन डे वन ना तो वन इनटू वन माइनस वन इनटू वन डेट इस माइनस वन इन नेक्स्ट नंबर T के वैल्यू वैल्यूएट है ना T इक्वेशन T T2 is minus 5. So, 1 minus 1 into minus 5. Minus 1 into minus 5 is equal to plus 5. So, 1 plus 5 is equal to 6. So, we will take the value. Now, we will take the second step to the application. Next, again, values are exchanged. R2 is equal to value. R1 is equal to R2. That is equal to S2 is equal to S1. S2 is equal to S1. S2 लेके आनु, अद्वान T2 लाला द, T1 लेके आनु, T लाला द, T2 लेके आनु। नमला next step अपडेश। 
21 divided by 7. We will get the quotient 3 and remainder 0. We will mark the S indication. Now, 1 minus 1 in order to mark S1 as 2 in order values. The equation will say 1 minus Q as 2 in order to So, S1 minus Q as 2. S1 is 1 in order 1. Minus Q is 3. 1 minus 3 into S2 in order minus 1. Order. So, 1 minus 3 into minus 1. So, minus 3 into minus 1 over into plus 3 i. So, 1 plus 3 equal to 4. So, answer number 4. In the next step, we will the evaluation. That is, T1 in the value minus 5 and T2 in the value 6. So, T1 minus Q T2 is the equation. So, T1 in the value minus 5. That is, minus 5 minus Q over 3. 3 into 6. 3 into 6 is 3 i, 18 i. Minus 5 minus 18. Apo 18 5 is equal to minus 23 i. Again, values are exchanged from R2 to R1 and R2 to R2. That is S2 to S1, S2 to S2. Again, from T2 to T1 and T2 to T2. Clear situation is equal to 0 i. GCD that is equal to 7. So, we will stop out. So, this time, we will get the values of S1 and T1. That is, S1 and T1 will get the same value. That is, S1 and T1 will get the same value. So, this minus 1 will be the value of S and 6 will be the value of T. So, GCD of 161.28 is equal to 7 along with R1. So, S is equal to minus 1 and T is equal to 6. Now, the answers are the linear combinations. S into A plus T into B. S into value minus 1 and minus 1 into 161 plus T into B and that is 6 into 28 is equal to 7. Equation is the So, this is the method of uh, solving a problem using extended Euclidean algorithm. Euclidean algorithm is the first four columns and diagonal extended arm by S T the values will calculate and very well. S1, S2, S1 and moon columns add in and the core again T1, T2, T1 and the moon columns in the adding. Updations are the general equations in the S in the case of the value S in the other portal. A borrow step in the R variable name, S variable name, T variable name update in the moon body to work. In R2 equal to 0 arm situation, we will get the value of GCD as R1. At R time, S1 and T1 will be required values of S and T. Next, A equal to 79, B equal to 0. Find GCD as A, B and the values of S and T. We will use the table in the table. B equal to 0. So, GCD of 17, 0 and then the first criterion is GCD of A, 0. That is equivalent to A then A. That is GCD of value of 17 then A. So, the equation of the table is process change in STM are thrown in the portion R1, R2 remainder. R1 is 17, R2 is 0. S1, S2 initial values are that is 1 and 0. That is equivalent. T1, T2 initial values are 0, 1, 1. So, 1 into 17 plus 0 into 0 equal to 17. 1 into 17 into 17 equal to 0, 0 equal to 0 into 17. This table and calculation only will be calculated using the first factor. The Euclidean algorithm is the first factor of GCD of A, 0 equal to this A in one and the result. So, 17, 0 and the number of values are numbers. So, answer will be equal to 17. Next step, A equal to 0 and B equal to 45. B case will then be given. The serial answer will be same as this 45 only. Because, one element is 0 and 5 and the value will be given the number and that will be the result. So, the serial of A, B is equal to the serial of B, A and the first class will be given. A, B and the serial of B, A and the serial of B, the answer will be the same. So, the table will represent the result. R1 is 0, R2 is 45, quotient is 0 and remainder is 0, S1 is 2 in it, initial value is 0, T1, T2 in it, initial value is 0. 
പെൻഷൻ വാല്യൂസ് ഉപയോഗിച്ചുള്ള കാൽക്കുലേഷൻ മാത്രമേ ഇതിൽ വരുന്നുള്ളൂ അപ്പൊ ഇതിനെ നമ്മൾ ലീനിയർ കോമ്പിനേഷൻ ആയിട്ട് റെപ്രസെന്റ് ചെയ്യുമ്പോൾ എസ് ഈക്വൾ ടു സീറോ ആൻഡ് ടി ഈക്വൾ ടു വൺ സീറോ ഇൻറ്റു സീറോ പ്ലസ് വൺ ഇൻറ്റു ഫോർട്ടി ഫൈവ് ഈക്വൽ ടു ഫോർട്ടി ഫൈവ് എസ് ഈക്വൾ ടു സീറോ ആയി ടി ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ ആയി സോ ജി സി ഡി എഫ് എ കോമ ബി ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു ഫോർട്ടി ഫൈവ് സോ ദിസ് ഇസ് ദ മെത്തേഡ് ഓഫ് ഇവാലുവേഷൻ യൂസിംഗ് എക്സ്റ്റൻഡ് യൂക്ലീഡിയൻ അൽഗോലിയം